Hello, my dear friends, and welcome to the new video. Uh, actually, it's noon before my birthday, and I'm so excited uh, before my 33rd birthday. And uh, there is my like birthday haul, I say. Uh, and this is blouse in bright orangey red color i like it for material because the front of the blouse looks silky but the back uh, is uh, not silk and um, i think this model is go for a plus size women and this blouse is true spring and true summer because of the beautiful patterns uh, roses it's italian blouse it's it speaks for it because look at the fitting it's so beautiful and so nice but it's a bit short probably it's for petite women i'm too tall for this blouse but i like the color and the spring mood of it And uh, this is Nike, Nike Air t-shirt. Uh, actually, I like um, the Nike sports uniform. Uh, it's about uh, sports spirit and it's close to my aesthetic for the sportswear. I usually choose Nike. So I bought this uh, nice t-shirt for me. And I hope I will start my sport season soon. Uh, this um, shirt looks like a military one. I like it for color. It's sage green. Um, but uh, the material itself looks cheap. Even with these golden buttons um, material doesn't look well and I think it's too long and these uh, are trousers with really interesting stripes at the front and a uh, little bit cuts at the front I think these trousers are a bit short for me because um, these cuts look strange. I don't know how to wear with uh, boots or maybe with shoes because now it's spring and you have to wear like boots and with boots it doesn't look nice. So it probably will go with nice heels for the evening dress. Yeah, for stylization, but not, uh, not for everyday life. And these are Italian trousers. Uh, it's sheer a bit. And um, when I put it on, I understood that this sheerness looks cheap. And unfortunately, I don't like it. And the material looks too simple. These are scotch and soda shorts. I like these shorts for this baby blue pink color it fits me it fits me well but um, maybe I need white leg I'm still thinking about these shorts uh, from the first sight I like it but I am still thinking and uh, these um, combo suit from, from Italy I like the pattern pattern looks so beautiful so eye-catching uh, i'm still thinking about trousers because they are too short and uh, talking about the length yeah it's a it's a tough question for me because i'm 182 centimeters tall and this is another day i found a really beautiful pattern on these leggings uh, it's collaboration with H&M and a famous artist, British artist. Uh, his name is 
written on these leggings. And he was so popular in 1970s. Uh, this rope is not Victoria's Secret, but it has Victoria's Secret's vibe in it. I like the stripes and these uh, colors. Uh, it looks so cozy and it's made in Germany. So it's in really nice quality. I like this rope and I bought it for me. It was absolutely new. And this uh, is my Maschina total neck. I really like the style. And um, uh, this uh, t-shirt from uh, Olympic event. I don't... Oh, it's uh, something about... Um, oh. Maybe Adidas or I don't know. Maybe I bought it. I chosen it for the color. And this t-shirt I also chosen for the color. It's written asphalt. Uh, but I like the combination of colors. So it's in br dark brown with really eye-catching patterns. And this blouse by Kelvin Klein. It speaks for 2000s. Really nice, but um, really strange sleeves and length. I think it's not go for me. I mean, it's two two thousands for me. <laughs> yeah, I look I look vintage in it. And this is an other stories. I don't have any items in my wardrobe from this brand. I tried this one and I said no because of the fitting. The straps are too simple and the length is too short. So maybe I will find something else from this brand. Uh, this uh, shirt uh, from Copenhagen. Laura Ashley, as I remember the name of designer. Um, but uh, this polka dot on pink like, also looks cheap. I don't like it and this uh, is Tommy Hilfiger jeans jacket and this is vintage vintage uh, jacket I say uh, vintage blazer I bought it for myself and I really like the fitting only vintage blazers they fit like this uh, on jeans uh, unfortunately the buttons looks ugly but if i will wear with the skirt i'm pretty sure it will be my go-to in my wardrobe this blazer uh, looks like a uniform or something um, extra because it's uh, in velvet with these golden buttons with two rows of buttons so I catch in but it's synthetic I don't like synthetic materials and I said no and this is Levi's skinny jeans yeah i know you you will say that it's not in fashion now it's a bit too old and uh, it looks nice on me uh, it's underlined as the best side of my legs and looks i look even taller than i am so i bought it for myself maybe the this style this fitting will come back And uh, this um, pullover I like for the neck. It's square neck, really interesting. I like the colors. This camel beige, really eye-catching, really nice. Uh, but on me it looks strange. Maybe with nice necklace or... I think uh, the problem is in color. My skin tone doesn't go well with this tone. Uh, 
and uh, this is Ghani dress. It's my first thing from Ghani. I like uh, the patterns they have. So it's Scandinavian brand and it's it looks simple, but at the same time it looks original. Look at this short dress with long sleeves. It will be so eye-catching with the, the cowboy boots or in summer with straw hat for the hot days. And I've bought it for myself to my collection. I like the fitting, it's original and uh, my body looks nice in it. Also, I'm looking for a good uh, sports jacket, but no one goes well for me. And this is Tommy Hilfiger stripe blouse. Um, looks nice. Um, I think as a um, uh, second layer, it will be really nice for my wardrobe. It will be bright accent and honestly speaking, I don't have anything with black and white stripe. I think it's essential for the interesting wardrobe that I'm trying to get. So I bought it for myself. And this is my look of the day. I'm wearing clear part uh, pattern pullover with my jeans. That's simple but bright. And this is True Classics Wrangles vest. Uh, I was looking for this jeans vest for a while and I think this one looks nice. Uh, the only thing was uh, my um, boost. When you look at this vest, you don't see the boots at all. And yeah, I, I, want, I want it to look maybe more ascent. But I still think about uh, the vest as item for stylization. This is the woolen vest with uh, nice buttons, but uh, buttons uh, were not uh, made in metal, it was plastic. So unfortunately, yeah, also it looks cheap. And this blue color looks nice. I like it. And this is Cambridge. I think uh, it's uh, from the souvenir store. Uh, like um, maybe part of uniform or maybe it's uh, just a merch from the Cambridge University. Uh, the pattern looks like true uh, Scandinavian, but they say it's true British style, true Cambridge. I don't know. Maybe uh, the problem is in blue color or maybe it's synthetic, but I don't like it at all. Uh, but what, look at this pattern. It, this is Zara. Uh, Zara dress and I love this pattern so interesting and eye-catching like in Gucci stylization it will look nice um, unfortunately uh, it doesn't go well as a dress but if I wear it as a blouse uh, I thought it will be okay but the size is too small for me this is M size and probably I need L Uh, this is uh, Diana, but not the Princess Diana, it's something vintage, uh, with really nice neck decorated with buttons and uh, looks so shiny. Uh, unfortunately, the black is not my color. I mean, it's not my uh, mood color. I want something brighter, I want something nicer, and uh, the... Decoration is too much, too extra for every day. 
And uh, I think that's it. This is the part of my birthday. And uh, I went to the theater uh, with my husband. We visited uh, the Jewish theater. Uh, theater, it was opened recently after renovation. And this is the part of the history. So thank you for watching and I wish you to have a really nice time and to look amazing and eye-catching. Thank you for watching and see you.